Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm Mr. Stan's Daily Rambles. Today we are doing The Flash and we're doing Season 4, Episode 3, Lady Be a Luck. Uh, this, we're just going to jump into it, but I gotta start to say afterwards. Okay. So we start off with um, the thinker is uh, recording um, or observing this uh, girl, Becky. And she's a really unlucky, lucky person. So basically, um, she was on a bus with a bunch of different people, and then something happened. We don't know what happened. It was just like an orange flight, and that's kind of how they left it. So, uh, a few weeks later, um, we start off with the Flash uh, playing laser tag, which was kind of funny because uh, Cisco's like, run, Barry, run! And a bunch of little kids got him. And, <laughs> and um, said, so, you know, got him out of the game along with Cisco. But Caitlin was still playing, and I think she pretty much won, <laughs> which was so funny. Um, I just, it's like, it's just kind of funny because, like, you know, he's the Flash, but he got beat up by a bunch of little kids. So, super great. And then, so they had Team Flash, um, just, you know, uh, and also, um, Cisco used, um, you have failed this. Uh, city, which is the offer, you know, Green Arrow reference, which I thought was really great. And it's basically just a Team Flash outing. They're just having fun, having a picnic, and just a bunch of awesome stuff. And then um, they go back to Star Labs where Wells is back, but um, Wally thought it was Jesse coming back, and it just gets so freaking awkward, and I love it. And basically, Jesse breaks up with Wally through a breakup cube, which is not on, you know, Earth, period. It's just on Earth, too. So, uh... <laughs> so, uh... Harry, um, Wells had to basically get the details of the message because it kind of uh, shorted out and decided not to work. So he had to basically relay everything and saying that, uh, he was the first. <laughs> okay? <laughs> so it was really awkward, but it was funny as F. It was the funniest thing ever. And so now, um, then we could go back to Becky, and it turns out she's uber lucky now. She's super uber lucky now. And then we cut to, well, um, but when she is lucky, everyone else around her gets unlucky. So, uh, so the Flash was, uh, she said so she was back into a bank and she just kind of just walked into the money. Uh, Flash tried to catch her, but he literally did a cartoon move and slipped on a bunch of marbles and got away. So, um, the, then, um, also Joe's house is, was leaking and, um, the, so, um, what's her name? I want to say, Dummy, you wrote it down. Lucille. There we go. Uh, caught a plumber because Joe's been doing it for 18 years. It hasn't been that great. And the plumber says it's going to cost $15,000. <sighs> I would pass out and throw up. My God. You know, honey. <laughs> and so uh, Lucille suggests selling the house. And he's like, I'll think about it. But, this, but my grandfather bought this house for $15,000. And it's going to cost that much to repair it. So anyway, um, but he said he'll think about it. Then, um, then Barry saw, um, Iris's wedding dress, so that's not going to really going to fly now, so that's kind of bad luck. And then, um, the, the main place they wanted to have the wedding got booked, and then their backup got booked. And so, um, the wedding is in six weeks, so they got to find a place in six weeks to do this. And so then the thinker... Observes Becky some more, and then we have Cisco and Wells are bickering. And it turns out the bus was there when Barry came out of the speed force, and that brought away the dark matter and um, infected a busload of new metas. And then we have um, Cisco and Wells decides to bicker some more. Basically, Wells blaming Cisco for everything. And then um, the house is now leaking slash raining in the house. So, um, Barry, uh, turned off the, um, the water, and he said, don't ever go in that crawl space. It's so gross. And then, um, then we have Becky at Jitter, so Barry tries, uh, to talk to her, and it doesn't really work well. She's just kind of going to do her own thing anyway. So she's like, bye. 
And then Iris is at a church, and it was a funeral. And after the funeral, she immediately wants to get married to Barry, like ASAP. So, um, <laughs> so basically, what, um, you basically have irrational Iris basically taking the Damien's portrait off and just pushing it to the side. It's like, okay, let's get married. Let's do it. Let's chop, chop, chop. So they actually, the guy's actually going to do it. The pastor actually is going to do it. And then uh, the pastor's kid or someone, a little kid in the church was, I guess, was helping the pastor out. Uh, you sent him an incense, which the pastor was allergic to. So that didn't turn out so great. <laughs> and so uh, that happened. And then Jesse basically... Uh, Get catch Wells off the team because he created a team for Jesse and on Earth 2 to can help out, and he got two Wells for them. So Jesse officially get them out of the team that he put together, which is messed up. And then we find out all the bad luck is happening because she's at a casino and keeps on winning. And then we have the particle accelerator is back online and will explode. And then Barry goes to the casino and literally tripped and handcuffed himself on some coins. <laughs> and then, um, then the PA, and uh, then Wells and Cisco are trying to, um, literally disconnect the vertical accelerator, accelerator and, um, Wells is just like, just let it happen, just let it happen. So it went off and basically d let Becky for a minute, kind of offset everything, and basically um, gave Barry enough time to arrest Becky. Then Wells apologizes to Cisco, and basically found a way to track the meds, and turns out there's only 12 of them, and I booked up two. And so then, um, the mod just pops up out of nowhere, and it says, uh, y'all didn't know I was gone? Basically, he went to Earth 2 to confront Jesse and to talk, and then he says he's going to leave and go to a different city for a little bit. He stayed with a friend. So, um, we have that. And then the thinker is actually spying on, um, spying on the flash of his samuroid, um, head. And then we have Joe decides to sell the house, but Cecile says she wants to stay, and tells him that she's pregnant, and then Joe is just kind of shocked, and that's the end of the episode. I wanted its reaction already. It's not fur. Okay. This episode is an A+. Plus. I thoroughly enjoyed it so much. It was so funny. I literally snorted with laughter, and I rarely, rarely do that. It was so funny. I would have little tears in my eyes. Or It was just so funny. I, I, I just enjoyed the whole thing, and um, I like how... Um, Earth 2 Wells has got more of a sass now. He's not as a, much of an ass now. He's more like um, I don't know. He's still kind of an ass, but not as big as one. And so I feel like he's known about him being a little bit touch more funny. I think what they did was they just combined Earth 19 Wells and Earth 2 Wells and just kind of merged them together. So that way they kind of um, they just got a little bit of an ass. They got a bit of funny. Just kind of put it together. And that's basically this new type of Wells. So I do like that. Um, I think that was going to be very interesting how that's what happened because I, I find it super interesting. So um, I'm very excited to see where that's going to go. And I wonder when, I don't, I don't remember what happened to Tracy at all. Um, they didn't really acknowledge her in the season premiere. So I don't know what happened to her or if she'll be coming back. And I don't know if Wally is actually going to Teen Titans, which is another show that's coming on in like next year. He's saying he's going out of town, and I'm the same town that the Teen Titans show was on, so I don't know how, if that's going to connect, and that's how they connect to the Arrowverse. So I don't know how that's going to happen, but I'm very excited to see what's going to happen with this season, because they have, they have the perfect combination of funny and serious, and I really, really like that a lot. And it was just a really good episode. I, like, I think I gave it A+. I'm just reiterating it. And if you made it this far, I thank you and I want y'all to have a super awesome day. And I'll see y'all in my next video. So just please like, comment, and subscribe. And that'll be awesome. Bye, everybody.